The good part is that you can sub whatever you like. You can take what certificate you like. I don't really care about that, to be honest. Bone plating. That, I don't really care about that because I always was just playing on my main. So, so subclasses are, for me, they're always here just to get skills and that's all. I don't really care, I never really gave a shit about what subclass I have. So that's whatever. There's no way I'm getting dove by himself. If I'm getting dove, this is going to be. Yeah. Exactly that. Surprisingly, I don't know how he ate the turret aggro there, but that's pretty useful actually. Oh, and she pulled a minion. Alright, you know what I said all about so many times? Well, what I said about minions, like just freaking. Tra traveling after you. I take it back, man. I like this now. <laughs> I like this change. Need to focus. I didn't even see that he has no flash. I mean, I would not survive this gank, but it doesn't matter that I knew or not, but he has no ignite, I mean no sums now. Still lost insane amount of experience, right? Something we need to understand. This was not good for me. It's like, it could be worse, but it was still not good for me. I kinda don't want to go back right now, not gonna lie. Flash that. Missing a shit little farm in the meantime. But I don't think I could play that any better, I'll be honest. I don't think what else I could do.
so brainless. And he gets a freeze here too. And my bot lane is getting dumpstered in the meantime. Like... So cringe, man. Hey! I, I love, like, this uh, This always the most brain that freaking response. Like, wh why do I have to play 1v3? Because you play Nasus, alright? Uh, if, if, if we were playing 3v3, then I play Nasus and we still slaughter them if I just had help. Now, wh what correlation does it have? Me playing weak side and playing Nasus at the same time. I'm not, I'm not weaker than this guy, I'm stronger than him. So, like, what does it, like, what, what, point, what, what point does it make that I play Nasus? What does it do? I don't understand. It's always the most brain that freaking answer. From junglers that don't do anything. I don't know if I had flash, bro. I knew he's there, but I couldn't walk up. Wonder why Elise would take the tower aggro first? She didn't. Like Elise Kled is like one of the most cancerous combos imaginable in top lane because Kled demounts, Kled takes aggro, he demounts, and then he loses the aggro once demounted. I'm gonna lie, I'm going to be pretty mad if, if, like, whatever, let's, let's just play for now. Cringe is freaking cancer champion, man. He's two levels advantage on me. Huh. I mean, you know, given how much I had to sacrifice top lane, because I was playing 1v3, it makes sense. What's up, DJ Mix, and welcome back, everyone. How are you doing, guys? We're having a very rough game here. We're playing 1v3. Nice. 
nice. I got blocked by a freaking minion. <clears throat> he lived through this last queue, man. Unlucky. <laughs> nice try, bro. gonna take a lot of patience guys to not freaking drop some F bombs in this game oh my ult I can't fight this he jumps into melee range and it's all good he's probably gonna turn in this and try that again I should be able to kill him with my ult up though, I hope. Someone could be here though, but I'll be honest, I'm willing to take some risks this game at this point. Never mind. That's impossible, I have no ghost too, so... Someone is probably here. The map is too dark. Rough? No, it's good. My teammates can carry now, right? They permanently have three people advantage on the map. I'm playing 1v3 all game long. And I still have CS advantage on CS advantage on Clyde. Surely my team just carries now. Like all I have to do is to sit back and relax. Like playing the the entire game long one v one v three, surely will give us some benefits somewhere else on the map, right? It's just it has to happen. There's no way. There's no other way, right? That this can work. We got this now, easy. He's kind of into it. It's nice. Oh, 
That's both sums, but it's worth it. Unfortunately, I can't push the tower because Kled is coming here. How did that Felius die, man? It's gonna be so freaking atrociously hard. <laughs> I'm telling you right now. Tell you right now, guys. Zero for Leeson, zero objectives, no dragons, nothing here, no allowing Elise to 1v2 me top permanently, and Ashkan at the same time. Nice hook. Big. Potentially could be Baron. We're actually gonna move there. This turn. I can't steal this, it's just Milio. There's no way. He should be going tank, man. He's he was zero and five, and he's going full damage, bro. Come on, dude. Right. I mean. One wither wasn't enough, I have another one, man. Relax. Alright, good job. Leeson is, is still freaking bannable. I'm, just, I'm like, uh, you know what, like, I don't wanna... I don't wanna be that guy, but 
this Lee Sin, like, I tried so hard, by the way, not to flame this game. You guys don't understand how hard I tried. You guys just don't get it. This guy's toppling. It's free. At least should be dead. She flashed. She still died. Fled died. Alright, I feel like it's too strong at this point. Alright, at least, like, weak siding me in the end was kind of worth it, but, like, how well I played is still, man. Like, look at the, my impact in this game while Kled was perma 1v3. 3v1. Three, three, three rather. That was unlucky. I got CC'd for slightly too long there. I say so myself. <clears throat> that was unlucky. Is that, by the way, if I had crit last hit, I at least was dead. But I didn't get it. Akali just couldn't finish this guy, <laughs> like he was living with 10 health for a couple seconds and he's he lived in the end. At least in strikes again. Oh my lord! Oh my lord. Holy should I say. The fact that someone could lose to this Lee Sin is freaking... Is, is freaking disturbing, man. <laughs> it's had to be one of the worst Lee Sin players I've seen in my freaking life, bro. I'm sorry, bro. But this is... I haven't seen this guy play once a single time the entire game long. It's freaking impressive. It's been 26 minutes, bro. Not a good, not a single good macro play either. Just nothing, nothing at all. How is it possible? Man? It's not going to be easy to do this. Probably should wait for Baron. We do it very fast. First good play. About time.
just gonna, gonna freaking flash on this guy, man. He's he doesn't want to die. Jeez, boys. <clears throat> this game was very, stre very stressful. I mean, very. But I'll be honest, that was just freaking severe top gap. Like, mostly, I don't know what to do with this guy. Like, legitimately, it felt... Like, guys, like, sometimes, like, people say that I'm too harsh, perhaps. Like, some people that I play with legitimately feels like they're just purchased their accounts. It doesn't make sense what this guy was doing at all, you know? Like, I'm sorry, bro. He did 11,000 damage. No objectives. Preventing from, from the dives. Shadowing maybe me or something like protecting no nothing nothing at all whatsoever Full clear that that's what we do as leeson Like I'm sorry man. Like what 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 deal was this guy? I think I played pretty damn freaking well, dude. I really do Close to close to no mistakes in this game. We have a little beat. 